I'm so excited about today's video because I get to finally share with you my collection of shoes for cold weather. These are shoes that I use throughout the fall season and spring season. I've collected them throughout the years. They're very high quality and comfortable, comfortable shoes. That's so important. And because there's so many of them, I categorize them as flat shoes, booties, and tall boots. So I'm going to make three separate videos videos, a series of three for you to watch. This is the first one, so let's get started. This is the first pair that I want to show you. These are called the Allbirds. Great for office work, for travel. They're very flexible, they're washable. You can take the insert out and it's very nice and spongy and cushiony. These are great for longer walks. I keep this pair usually with me in the car, in the trunk at all times. So if you need to switch a pair, if your feet are hurting for whatever reason, they're very small and you can even tuck them in your purse, in your day purse, wherever you are. I really like that it's it's simple. It's simple and it blends in with my feet very nicely. I picked this shade because it's, it looks like I don't have any shoes on. It's like wearing socks pretty much. Subtle elastic band here, which is, you can't really tell it's elastic. One of the things that I look for in flat shoes particularly, I love ballet flat shoes, but I can't find any pair that wouldn't hurt my feet. And I have tried hundreds of them. This is the first pair that has not hurt my feet, not after maybe after 10 hours because of the elastic band. So depends on your tolerance level as well. Uh, my feet are very, very sensitive. So I have a very hard time finding shoes that don't pinch, don't cause blisters, even with hosiery, even with socks. I specifically like this pair also because it goes very well with pants, with skirts and dresses. Like the one I'm wearing right Right now yes we can wear heels for dresses but to find flats that are very subtle and blend in with your leg is a bit more challenging so this is the pair for you the next pair is these white leather flats they are by Vince and I recommended them before. They are 100% leather, including the lining. Very important because you don't want it to fall apart. They are very simple. They are slip-ons. They almost look like boat shoes, but I love these so much because there are no embellishments, no other shades included. It's the plainest, simplest pair of shoes. They're so elegant. They go even with skirts and I've worn them even with summer dresses and then they transition nicely into fall if you wear white jeans or uh, perhaps a white blazer, white shirt. So if you think I really like the white ones, then guess what? I have them in brown. <laughs> I purchased this in brown as well because these are brown suede and of course everything for the fall, the majority of our clothes are brown so I had to have the brown shade. It's a style preference because it goes with a brown belt, brown sweaters, blazers, trench coats, whatever you have that's brown, you have to have a pair of the brown flats. Again, it's the same simple style, they're very comfortable and long lasting and of course I usually wear everything unless it's open toe I always wear hosiery with them so it doesn't rub against my skin and I have no blisters and no issues all day long all of the shoes that I'm mentioning are work appropriate so my next one is these black ones these ones are by Kate Spade they are so beautiful because of they're similar to the other ones because they are very simple I originally purchased these just for regular black slacks so the inside is also leather lining the outside is suede I've had this for at least two seasons now and they're very comfortable I love that they are transitioning well between uh, pants my black slacks and um, any dress that I have long sleeve dress that usually tend to be darker in the fall I wear a lot of black for some reason and gray in the fall and winter so these are great for that for indoor especially for office wear if you're traveling and you just want to look elegant my next pair I use for casual looks when I want to wear pants or jeans Jeans or be relaxed and hang out as a family with the kids perhaps or in the weekend or maybe when you're traveling you can still do that uh, kind of stylishly and elegantly so this is my pair 
Uh, these are suede. They look like uh, sneakers and perhaps they are, but I really like the detail here, the bottom, that it's darker, it's not white. White gets dirty so fast. So this to me is uh, a little bit different than everything else that I have simply because everything else is usually very, very thin with a thin sole. Um, they are pretty much sneakers. They're made out of suede and they're so elegant for a pair of sneakers. My goodness, I wear this with jeans, like a pair of dark jeans and a blazer and a t-shirt under it. It's just like the best jeans look you could ever have. And they're so comfortable. They have padding inside. I actually purchased these by accident when I was searching on Nordstrom Rack's website for comfort shoes. And you might want to check that out. You'd be surprised of the styles that you see. Um, they're very comfortable. I've had these for a couple of seasons. They don't get dirty. They're very easy to uh, rub off or just brush off. If you have a brush, I highly recommend you clean them that way. Again, a very stylish, elegant look for a smart, casual uh, outfit. This is my collection. I recommend for fall, for spring, also for workwear. Uh, these are my go-to shoes that I wear really throughout the year if I need to. If, because in the office it's colder, or if you're traveling, uh, any of those combinations. I didn't put in the white leather sneaker jeans in this video because I think that's a very uh, common, but summer look. So I don't really wear those in a fall because fall comes with wetness, with mud, and you don't want your white sneakers to get dirty. So that's why I didn't put it in this video, but I still have them and I use them. I probably will put them away now that summer's over. I will link everything in the description box below for you to check them out if you're interested if it's not the exact same pair i will put something similar but most of them are classics that come back over and over or just stay throughout the year because they're doing very very well i want to mention the price point for these shoes they are not cheap so if you're looking for something quick and easy these shoes are not for you i was looking for investment pieces comfort and quality these these two were very, very important to me. And, and I recommend that you do the same. If there's anything you want to invest in, would be shoes. You have to wear them a lot. You have to walk a lot. Your feet cannot be hurting. And in addition, of course, if you can look stylish too, well, that's a bonus. <laughs> um, but I always look at comfort and quality. So the price range for the majority of these, I would say they average at $100. If you are looking for tips on how to purchase more expensive things at a lower cost, then I will link down below my video on um, how to give you the tips for shopping. Stay tuned for my next episode in the fall series, which will be booties. I'll see you there.